Okay, here's my homemade prototype spring loaded single shot tray to fit a Benjamin Marauder 2 2 rifle that I'm going to put on my modified QB78 that accepts these magazines. But the parts will all be put on Thingiverse and I'll put a link in the description. But the, the two parts that are printed off and a small M3 screw. I'll also try and put the link to that in the description. And a small spring. Um, could probably get one from a, a clicky ballpoint pen, but this one didn't fit. So I had to resort to rummaging through a box of springs I'd got kicking about and found a suitable one. As long as it's no more than 5mm diameter overall and approximately 22 to 20 mil long when it's fully extended um, all I'm going to do is I'm going to just basically there's a small hole that the spring try not to drop it because I'll never find it again it goes in that hole there that's probably better like that goes in there and then in this part I don't know if you can see that there's a very small post that the other end sits over when it's assembled right I shall now put them together because I can't do it with one hand so bear with me right now I've got that put in there I don't know if you can see that there's a there it sits in the recess on that part and sits over the post on that part and there should be enough travel to still be under tension at the maximum and compress fully so that the pellet hole lines up with the or the inner hole can line up with the outer hole and now put the small three mil screw into that hole um, again needs two hands so bear with me Right, as you can see, I've got the screw fitted in there. I did pre-tap the hole three millimeters so it didn't break any of the plastic. And this is made out of ABS Plus. Um, you can use basically anything you want. Um, it has been filed down or with some sandpaper and some small files. Because this is a prototype, I've still got some fettling to do on the overall design because as you can see, there's a little gap there when it is fully open and I want to try and get that to be fully covered by the end of the middle inner piece so when the bolt is cocked and then released it's still under a bit of spring pressure and it can just go in there you can see the little indent when it when it shows it there's a small indent there and if I make this longer that should block that off so it Cannot, it can't make that indent um, so basically all you do is you take the, the the tray insert it like you do and that might look a bit odd because I've only got the, right bear with me as you can see just insert it like you would the standard magazine uh, right pull that back as you can see, it clicks into place just like the normal magazine. You can see, it just sticks out a little bit there. On the next model, it will stick out a little bit more to allow for the extra bit to cover the hole. But as you can see, it stops the bolt going forward. Um, and the modified one, hopefully, I should be able to just push this in and it will click forward to push the pellet in. But with this, you just insert your pellet. Um, get there, see if you can do it while I'm push that in let go of the bolt and then obviously the bolt goes in like it would with the normal magazine which would load your pellet and then when you fired the pellet which is no pellet in there so fire it unlock the bolt and voila it appears for you to put a new pellet in 
and just keep carrying on and removal is the same as you would with a normal magazine but let's say this is my prototype it does work you just find a pellet right, just put some I'll probably drop this put them on camera that's it you just put the pellet in the hole on this one obviously you have to pull back slightly so push that in and you just push forward and down fire that into there see pellet's gone open the bowl and it pops out ready for the next round and now to take that out just pull that out try not to lose it and there you are a single shot spring loaded pellet magazine for this is a modified QB78 with a GM custom I think it is um, conversion on it but it uses the let's see 2.2 caliber 10 round Benjamin Marauder magazine and also I've got a three round magazine clip well three magazine clip can't get it in the right way upside down put that in there it just pushes in that's also on thingiverse 3d printed and I shall put a link to that and that's just a normal pellet tray that I found on thingiverse and printed but I thought this one looks fancier but I will change it and make it so that that gap in there disappears so that the bolt should click the pellet into position part way by just pushing on this end and closing it up like that so but as a first go it works pretty good all right thank you for watching